welcome back guys this is section 6.2 in which we have to see the parallel binary adders okay so previously we have seen the foundational concepts which are related to the adders so here we are more concerned related to the applications of the binary adders okay so this is question 4 and uh, the statement here is that for the parallel adder in figure 6.2 69 so this is figure 6169 determine the complete sum by analysis of the logical operation of this circuit okay so we have to analyze the operation of this circuit uh, verify your result by long head addition of the two input uh, numbers okay so uh, we have here these uh, numbers so as we have to add them together and we can see that here we have different numbers and what are these numbers we can see that here we have two numbers I have to add two numbers uh, let me call them A and B okay so A is composed of the three bits okay A is a three bit number B is a three bit number and what are those numbers so let me call it A0 this is A1 and this is a2 okay so this a is basically composed of a0 a1 a2 okay and similarly this is a b and for b this is b0 b1 and b okay so i can also write it b0 b1 and b2 and what are these these are basically the let me use another color for it so these are two are basically the lower significant bits and these two are the most significant bits in so uh, we can write them here as well so in order to write them here what i can do here more i can do here is, let me use this for it here so this is a so in a what is a naught a naught is zero what is a one a one one and what is a two this is zero so this is a first number for a second number which is b so for b we have here uh, b naught is one sorry b naught is one so here uh, b one is one and b2 is also one so these are the numbers and what are these uh, doing here these are basically adding them together so what i have to do this will add it first then this one okay and at the end this one okay so the output of it will be this one the output of it will be this one and from it i will not only get the output this sigma 3 while this sigma 4 which will be the output carry okay so we have to add them together and this is the conventional addition which i have to carry out i will start it from here which is lsb addition and will proceed toward this msb addition okay so uh, let me first add them together and after it i will add also these two numbers which are 0 1 0 and 1 1 1 as well okay so let me first start it so in starting it them i i have a concept that i have to start them from the right side so let me start them here so by adding them together what i have to do i will add all the numbers which are here so these are the numbers which are 1 0 0 okay so adding 1 0 0 what i will get this is a carry from the previous adder but as this is the first adder so there will be no previous adder so i have to uh, add 0 with it and all of these are the full adders this is a full adder this is a full adder and another full adder so adding 1 0 0 I will get 1 so 1 is basically 0 1 okay 1 0 0 is 0 1 so the output here this will be 1 and here I will get 0 which will be the carry okay so adding 1 0 0 I will have 0 okay? so this is the operation which I have followed here so here what is this this is 0 here and the two one ones are here 
So 1 plus 1 plus 0, so 1 plus 1 plus 0, this is what? This is 2 and in binary I can represent it by 1, 0, okay. So this is the summation, so summation is 0 while the carry bit here will be 1 which is transferred here to this C input or the input carry to this third add. Okay. Again, I have 1, 0, 1, so let me add them. So, 1, 0, 1 will be what? This is again 2 and 2 is 1, 0. So, here this sigma 3 is 0 while this sigma 4 is 1 which is the output carry uh, for my last uh, full ladder. So, here it will be 1, 0, 1, okay. So, this is what? This is the summation or the answer of this addition of these two numbers okay so this is what this is the addition which i have carried out by using these four okay so uh, let me proceed uh, here and uh, what i have to do this is the step in which i have to verify my answer okay so uh, here by adding them i can very easily see that 0 plus 1 is 1 1 1 is uh, what that is 1 0 so therefore i have to write here 0 and 1 will be carried here okay so what i will get here this will be 1 0 1 so this will be 2 so 2 is 1 double 0 1 okay so we can very easily see that this is the conventional method of addition and we can see that both of these answers are similar. So, we have carried out a method by using the parallel binary adder by using by adding two three bit numbers um, with the help of the uh, two bit full adder. So, so, this is a complete circuitry which we have performed here and in digital circuits the same procedure has been applied for addition of the numbers. So, I think the concept is now clear. If you have any issues, you can ask me in the comment box. So, take care of yourself. I will come back with the same type of interesting questions in our upcoming video. Take care of yourself and I will see you soon.